Go. Hi, I'm Darren from Black Magic Design here at IBC 2023 in Amsterdam. I'm going to take a quick look at the new Micro Studio Camera 4K G2. So this has been really widely anticipated for some time now. Lots of you have been asking for an update to the previous generation Micro Studio Camera, which we unfortunately had to discontinue. And here it is. But this is vastly improved. So it's got a brand new sensor in there. This is the, um, the dual data ISO 4K sensor that you'll find in the larger studio cameras. It's still a micro four thirds lens mount. So you can use your existing lenses if you're already working with this camera or those larger studio cameras. But we've improved other areas of this as well. So we've got micro BNCs for connectivity, and these work all the way up to 12 GSDI. So if you're working in live environments up to 4K at 60 frames per second, then this is going to be perfect for you. Um, you can also work in HD via HDMI, so you can still uh, optimize working with uh, off-board monitors or with HDMI based switches, for example. And then the really exciting thing is the fact it's got USB-C connectivity. So we can expand the, um, the use and application of this through tethering this to an Ethernet adapter and control this via REST API. Now this means we can control it in a number of different ways. Um, we can also utilize that USB-C connection as we are in this case with our Zoom and Focus demands. So if you are working with Blackmagic Zoom and Focus demands and you want to operate this camera with those, then you can do so. But the really exciting thing about the USB-C is that you can also record Blackmagic RAW to off-board SSDs. So this now makes this camera not only a live production camera, but also a cinema camera as well in a really compact form factor. We think it's going to be perfect for use in um, live environments, on stage trussing, um, in drum kits for example, or anywhere where you want a small uh, camera to be tucked away and hidden from view. But again, you can have this inside a car for uh, recording content that you want inside a vehicle for example, and it's a really small form factor. Um, this is going to be available really soon and we're really excited to see what you guys get up to with this new camera.